Hello, I'm Drawing Pin, and welcome to a brand new Let's Play for Starship Theory. Now, what is Starship Theory, you may be asking? Um, well, the best way to describe it is imagine if FTL and RimWorld, two excellent games, had a baby. It would probably be something like Starship Theory. It's very kind of FTL, but it's very RimWorld as well. Um, it, it's a really good game. I, I will put a warning straight away. Um, I don't want to start off negative, but I think I feel I've got to put this out there. It, it is a cheap game. I paid £2.70 for it. it. The price seems to have come down. It was languishing around about £10, which was kind of ridiculous. Uh, but, you know, I, I don't want to languish too much on that. But this has been, I'll say, effectively abandoned by the developer at the moment. So this is the game, unfortunately. Uh, I, I really hope they come back to it. Or I think it's just one developer, actually. Uh, one person. I think he hopefully he comes back to it and finishes it off. But I don't think that's going to happen. It's been well over a year since it had an update. It might even be longer than that. Um, but I, I picked it up a week or two ago and I've been playing a little bit and I figured, you know what, I'm going to do a little let's play on this. I don't know how long it'll last because there's not, I mean, there's a decent game here, but uh, I, I don't want to be too negative on it. But uh, it's a really good game. Uh, we're going to start with a new crew. I can name these crew members, so I will name them after people in the comments section and then we will be able to pick up new crew members. So if you do want to be featured in the uh in the crew please put it put your name in the comment below and uh, i will do that we could also name the pod because uh, we're going to do uh, there's different starts basically like medium hard and easy so you'll start with like a military transport so i think you've got some weapons mining you've just got a mining laser here well, this all is probably all um new to you but uh, what we're going to do is the hard starts we start in an escape pod we have basically nothing we're in a little one by two escape pod and we'll build up the ship and you know you can eventually build basically whatever ship you want really and there's a bunch of crew stats here agility just improvement speed uh, i think that's just endurance it's just like health and hunger levels uh, these are three stats that really count uh, engineering obviously building repairing that sort of thing uh, intelligence is like research science etc and then the combat is obviously you know combat skills um, but uh, I'm going to click around and try and get some decent mix of crew I want uh, some people with uh, engineering and uh, one or two uh, intelligent people yeah the more they do intelligent you know the more they build or do research they will level up those skills so uh, it's not necessary but uh, I'd quite like somebody with a uh, decent engineering and you know like three three bars in the uh, engineering and three in the intelligence and perhaps two uh, that's okay but the intelligence isn't great so i shall switch those around change the names uh, i'll name the ship but i think we'll probably uh, leave that open to you guys to name the ship as well and then i'll uh, come back in a minute right so here we are i've named the uh, crew i uh, did i name the ship i might not have named the ship well i'll leave that to you guys i think it's just like escape pod 2 or something at the moment so uh, yeah leave a leave a comment and uh, you know name a ship keep it uh, clean people <laughs> but uh, you know so here we are we're in our pod we always float i'll just unpause it for a second there we go we just float forwards never never backwards never you know can't go sideways can't slow down you're just always doing the same thing going forwards asteroids will come down we can make a mining laser and mine the asteroids and resources will pop out like metal silicon etc but let's pop over the ui because there's a lot of few too many of these panels really i'll just pop them all out but we don't actually need them all uh we could paint the hole couldn't we let's do the hole straight away uh go like a like that maybe we'll go with a kind of purpley blue for now that, that's fine but uh, we can we can repaint that later we can paint the floors and engines and all sorts of other stuff but that's fine so we've got notifications i don't think i really need that we've got tasks things they're doing so we can say hey prioritize that task but you can also just right click on it uh, select someone and right click and that'll be fine um we've got uh, sort of operations we can make somebody like a science officer and their their shirt will change color so uh, you can see that shirt there's change color etc make them a make them an engineer whatever but i think we'll just put that away uh, these are generally the panels i had open uh, there's a research panel as well but we probably don't need that yet because we've got to build a research 
um, station so uh, we don't need that just yet so here we go I've named everyone uh, oh damn it sorry Mr Girk I've just named I put an eye in your name <laughs> let me redo that one I've just renamed uh, the uh, crew after uh, people that comment there we go so there we go so we've got man of the people we've got Mr Girk we've got Nijik and we've got Solus Ginger so uh, hopefully I've, uh, I'm probably going to pronounce everyone's name correctly hopefully um, but if you uh, want to be a part of the crew put uh, put it in the comments down below um, because uh, we should be able to pick up some more crew members eventually but I think for right now we're probably going to be with four crew members for the foreseeable future um, as you can see uh, there's quite a lot of people with science uh, Mr. Girk and Man of the People have science um, and Solus Ginger is our main engineer but Nijek and Mr. Girk can also do engineering which is basically building so right uh, we've got up here let's go through these panels uh, we've got the shield we've got armor and we've got the structure at the moment we've only got structure we have no shield or armor we eventually can research all that heat that's going to be extremely important very quickly anything you do um, like fire a laser use a mining laser it's going to generate heat and we're going to need to build heat vents and vent the heat out um, and also we'll come across stars which will also up your heat so if you don't have any way to heat you could just set this thing on fire straight away and uh, you know that would not be good um, but uh, you know if you generate heat um, you will set fires off and that you know could burn your your machines whatever you've got inside engines things like those things of that nature asteroids will also come down and hit us and do damage if we don't knock them out of the way uh, so that's good um, got uh, ship accuracy we've got sensors but we don't have any of that there that's our ev evasion so as long as that's above zero I think it is this well this will charge anyway but then uh, if we're above zero we can actually jump so other ships will come in and be hostile or want to trade go hey or to trade or they'll just want to blow us out of the out of this out of the stars whatever they want to do and if they want to do that we could just jump away if we haven't got any weapons or anything um, we've got code so we can go red alert you know combat rolls repairs etc blue alert everybody get in or black alert abandon the ship uh, this is our cargo which is full at the moment i believe that's our cargo capacity yet yeah, we can build more storage later so this is metal silicon gold and water these we can mine out of the asteroids we'll break the asteroids apart and random colored color coded by these so red is metal dark blue silicon light blue water and obviously gold is gold and we'll harvest those with a mining laser and then we'll be able to use those to build like whole pieces and various bits and bobs here these are all locked so we have to build a research station and then get someone like mr girk or man of the people whoever who are good at science and they can then research earn points and then we can spend those points on the various bits and as you can see there's quite a bit of stuff lots of weapons lots of defense some of it's open already like the hull um and then this is power and cpu so everything's going to take so we'll go to this like uh where are we go for an engine there we go so that's going to cost 15 metal it's going to cost five eight silicon and it's also going to add structure so uh more hit points and then um yeah that's going to be the uh, evasion so it's going to up our evade by three and then that's the amount of pi uh, power and cpu that we're going to need to uh, do that so uh, that's fine but we're not going to need an engine right now what we're going to need first is an airlock because we can't get out of this thing so let's pop an airlock down we'll probably make most people engineers um who is no good at engineer man of the people do you know what yeah we'll leave you in the ship and uh, you can be a space janitor <laughs> there's nothing wrong with that Clean, cleaning's got to be done so we need that and then we'll set we can pause time speed it up etc and then i'll start laying out a bit of hull uh no we'll probably get let's not do that let's do it this way first come up the front here we're going to want to expand this like so and then maybe yeah, we could put some of those on why not there we are and then we'll remove these bits as well because how we can put floors down but how we need to put floors down is we need to fill this with hull and then we put the floor over the top of the hull um, so as long as there's a block separating you from the outside space um, you can put a floor down 
So we're going to need floors because then they, these guys are going to get out. They should get out in a minute and start fixing. They'll start doing the repairs and things that I've or the building that I've told them to do. And uh, man of the people is just going to stay in there because uh, just in case there's a fire or something, uh, they can put that out and they can, you know, clean up as well. There's nothing wrong with that. And so let's speed up the time and let them build a little bit now. And we'll get that built first. Uh, we're probably going to have to take that engine off. We are going to have to take that engine off. There's no problem about it because uh, we don't have enough silicon because um, we used five on that. And then we're going to build a mining laser, which is going to take another five. And then we also need a heat vent uh, to vent out where our heat vent. So we're going to need to be able to vent the heat that we generate from that mining laser. So let's pop that there. And then we'll get uh, we'll get an eject to make fix that up. There we go. Do that. And so you don't actually spend the resources until you build it. So it's not like uh, oh hello a asteroid field is on its way, but at the moment there is nothing we can do about that. Um, we're gonna get we're gonna take the engine off. There's nothing. There's not much we can do about that. We have to take the engine off. So Solus, go and fix that. And oh my god, please don't take us out. Please, this could end very quickly. There we go. So any bits you take apart as well, you'll get the resources back. So the small, very small engine costs eight silicon and 15 metal. So we'll get all that back. So that there's nothing wrong there. What we need is a bit of space so we can put a water cooler down because uh, we're going to need to eat and drink. And uh, yeah, I didn't go over this here. There's eat, drink. It's a bit hard to see really. There is morale, but I don't think that really does anything right now. It's not like RimWorld um, where... Uh, uh, you know, your your character would go crazy if they uh, had a dirty bedroom or whatever, you know, they'd, they'd get a break rest, whereas I don't believe that's implemented into the game, which is a shame, but, uh, you know. Uh, so we're not going to fire this, la this laser off just yet, because we're going to generate heat. Um, so we're just going to have to float along with no engine for the moment, but uh, we want to put that on as soon as we can, just this jump bar is starting to go up and we've dropped down a bit of evasion, so... There we go, right, we can now use the laser, so we're going to assign that to key one, and we can start mining these asteroids. They'll blow apart, and then resources will pop out various colours. Systems are overheating, so there we go, there's a bit of metal. And you know what, we're probably going to get another heat vent straight away, I think, because we're going to need it. So let's just vent that heat straight away. Uh, we need this zoomed out, because uh, just in case anything uh, comes across us. I mean, if we get one of those big ones, there's just nothing we could do about that. Uh, we want to get somebody... Uh, we'll get Solus. You come down there and fix that now. I want that, I want that up and running straight away. The rest of it's okay. We can zoom right out. We can move about as well. So that's fine. We can shut things down here as well in case we've got too much power or not enough power. So, oh, bit of water. There we go. Bit of silicon. There we are. Not a lot, but uh, eventually we can get lots of mining lasers and you know, build this thing out. So they're still working away. We'll leave it on one speed because just because we're uh, mining resources, hopefully we can get some. It's going to be a bit slow to start with. Oh god. Uh, I mean, that's the other thing. You do split them apart and send them on a collision course with your own ship at times. So, uh, you know, that's not good. Obviously. Let's destroy that just in case. Right, let's pause it. We'll get a hole down. So we put the hole down. And then once we build this, we'll be able to build a little row of floor there. And uh, the same down here. Once we build that, we'll be able to put a floor in there. And we can get a water cooler in. And we'll have to move some of this stuff. But uh, for right now, we're okay. Uh, it's, it's just essential we get water down and then we'll have to make a plant grow bed so we can grow some plants which will be for food a uh, ship is coming in a long range hopefully they're not hostile they're not usually in the first few goes but uh, you know they will become hostile very quickly and so we're going to either want to jump or bribe them with money uh, which is the green resource over there that's our credits as well and that's food also may not have gone over that so uh, Okay, let's get another whole section down there, and we'll just kind of make this square. I 
think I'll probably build that way. I don't want to make the thing too wide. Oh, we'll try and re-harvest that as much as we can, but I don't think we're going to do it. Come on, break. Break, break, break. We're going to get to the end of our... Oh, there we are. Oh, yeah, there we go. Metal, metal. It's probably metal and silicon are probably the two most important ones early on, and obviously water is pretty essential. Um, let's go hull. There we go, and then we should be able to start... Yeah, we could put a piece of floor there because that's surrounded. Okay, these guys are here. Uh, we don't have anything to sell them. Uh, I'd love to buy a crew member, but we don't have... We've got 400 credits and we have nothing to... I mean, we could sell the metal, but to be honest, that's so precious. It's still not going to get us a crew member. If we get a new crew member, I would do that. But I think right now we're just going to have to leave them as they are. I mean, we could... We could uh, you know, if we had lasers, we could shoot them out of the sky, but or the other space. But um, to be honest, there's not much gain. But uh, if you do destroy a ship, there's a chance that one of the crew member might fly over and join your crew. So th there's a bit of something, but you don't. You know, it's not like FTL where you can salvage weapons and and you know scrap metal and all sorts of other bits and bobs. Uh, you know, that, it doesn't do anything. But uh, uh, there's a chance a crew member, so I guess it does. But uh, we can't really buy anything, so uh, we'll just. Uh, Leave those guys be and I'll just they'll disappear in a little minute. Right, there we go. Let's get this floor down here because we're going to want to get a water cooler in. Uh, we're probably going to want to remove that solar panel and put it onto the outside. Um, and they do sleep as well, so we'll make bunk bunk beds or you know we'll make beds and things. Uh, right, asteroid field detected. What was that? It was a solar panel, wasn't it? So we've got no power right now. So we're going to want to put that solar panel there, and we want uh, we want Nijik get over there and do that now. Need that done quick, and then we're going to want slow it down. I'm going to want the water cooler in. I think they can access that there. So sort of. yeah, people get out of the way. Stop gathering. Move. Who is that man of the people? Would you move? please <laughs> okay uh, let's get another floor block in as well and we're going to yeah kind of everything's switched off oh what's why is everything switched off CPU panel yeah because the CPU panels off there we go let's switch everything back on we're gonna need more power but right now oh there we go we've already put it down that's good so there we go they can access water so they can have a drink uh, next thing is we'll move that CPU panel out of the way but for right now, I think we probably want to. Do we want to? Let's, let's move it. Let's remove the uh, CPU panel, and we'll put that there for now. So that's okay. So get somebody out there. Do that right now. Who is the best? Solus, get out there. That's it. You're doing it good. Get out there. Remove it. Okay, you're doing it. Fair enough. Who is that? Neject? Yeah, would you not butt in? Okay. And there we go. We make some make some space and we can make a food dispenser next because they're gonna want food. Uh but we've oh we've actually got a bit of silicon, just enough to do the food dispenser. So once they've put that, we'll get the food dispenser down. And then we'll think about expanding the hull a little bit. But let's get the food dispenser in first. Needs a bit of space, so uh, let's let them build that first. Just speed it up a little bit. Can't access water. Why can't you access water? There we go. Can you know, why can't you access water? Should be able to. Ah, the water cooler is off. There we go. That's why. That's why you can't access water. That explains it. So we don't have enough solar. So we do, yeah, we don't have enough power to run that mining laser. So I think we're going to build another solar panel straight away got the just got enough with silicon to do that and then do we have enough for the food dispenser as well we do okay let's build that as well and then once that's built we will uh, decide what else we need uh, we're gonna build down as I say I don't want to build out too wide because uh, uh, you know for right now we are gonna just put ourselves at the mercy of these um, asteroids so I think for now we don't want to do that has everybody had a drink? Yes, okay. Let's switch the water cooler off and we'll put the vents back on. Because everyone's had a drink, so everyone's fine. Oh, 
Oh, water. Let's grab it. We're going to run out of water. Let's grab that. Right. Okay. So let's put the water cooler back on because we've got enough power and we've got 17 whole blocks. I think they collect two. So let's just build like one more row down there for now. Um, and we could just extend that to hole a little bit. So we've got a bit more room. And we'll try and break that one, I think. Come on, there we go. Silicon. Now let's grab the metal. We might as well try and break that one, but uh, I don't know if we're going to do it. And they fly off in different directions, so even if we break it, it might, it might go somewhere else that we can't get to. No, we couldn't do it. Okay. Right, they're out there repairing that. And we're going to try and get a re research station so many other people can start um, doing some research. Oh, no, we're going to be on a grow bed. I'm going to stop growing some food actually. Um, can we do that now? Can we do a small plant bed? We don't have enough. I think we could put that there and it'll be okay. Uh, sometimes they need a bit of space around it uh, to be able to access it. So um, I think that'll work, but at the moment we don't have enough resources. So we need to try to mine up as much silicon as we can. All right, we need everything silicon water uh, gold uh, gold's useful because we can sell it but um, it's more of the late game stuff so you know the bigger reactors or something like that so we don't necessarily need it but you know I'll mine it if I see it obviously so let's just keep uh, mining away right let's pause it again we will get floor blocks down like a little bit more nope oh, crap no no that's a that's airlocks we don't want that <laughs> we do want more than one airlock eventually but right now we want floor blocks yeah we can't do that one yet because uh you know jack hasn't finished uh building that once he's finished we'll be able to put that one down so there we go that was good where we silica I mean metal and silicon are probably the two we want but water is going to be a good one as well that's a nice metal that's a good one and so metals for the floor and everything the hull so oh please don't hit us try and break it apart but uh, yeah there we go it just hit us oh damn okay oh it just did some damage so it's not too bad but it could like break off a solar panel or something and you know you have no silicon to repair it and so you're kind of screwed early in the game there we go come on move out of the way get it get it there we go right okay let's get a floor in uh we, do we have enough for that someone building that i don't know hopefully someone's building that uh that small plant bed because we're going to need it. We've got a food dispenser, but we're going to want to be able to replace that. I think one plant bed will probably well, that'll have to do us for now. Oh no! Oh, silicon though, silicon, silicon. Yes, absolutely fantastic. That's brilliant. Right, let's get a few more. Uh floor pieces down because we've uh, finished this floor how are we doing for metal yeah we're doing okay for metal so that's fine so let's um, pause it now and then we will uh, carry on harvesting uh, ooh. i think we'll be okay on that one uh, so close yeah i'd say I, i'd like to you know whoa no 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 yeah i'd like to oh god i'd like to widen out the craft but i think for now i'd like put some wings or something on it but um I'm not sure they'll want to do that just yet. Oh dear. Just because, you know, it's going to widen us out. You know, we could add some little wings here and maybe put some boosters on. But uh, I don't know if I actually want to do that just yet. Um, what have we got? 17. Yeah, we've not got much metal at all. Uh, can we build a small crate? 10 metal. I feel like we're going to build this small crate. Let's put this small crate in here. Some ship is detected on long range scanners. Uh, we should just have enough. Yeah, we'll have like five metal left. We can then take that one off because that is a little, uh, what is it? Uh, hat, cargo hatch. That's all that is at the moment. So we could take that off. That's going to give us five metal back. Uh, let's speed it up now because, yeah, we're kind of hurting on the resources. Uh, is the plant bed 
Ah, okay. Um, what do we need? We need CPU power. We may have to cancel that. CPU panel. No, we're okay. I think we'll be okay. Uh, let's put that like there. We'll, we'll, you know, eventually we can build like uh, a stack, and you know, we can have this inside. And same with uh, small reactors, or you know, we we could eventually get this stuff off the side. But for now, I think we'll just uh, leave it there. Star ahead is detected. Okay, so that's that's not going to be too much of an issue. We're not mining, so I think we can just about afford that, right? CPU panel five and two silicon that's okay and the small crate is 10 yeah that should be fine and then we'll get a little bit back from that one yeah so there we go so we can put the small plant bed on now so hopefully uh man of the people have we made you no let's make you a scientist now and you'll start working on that what do you want Ooh, a crew member i really wish we could do that sell 20 gold we don't really have anything food water silicon Buy metal? Ooh, do we buy the metal? Ooh, I'm kind of tempted to do that. Kind of tempted to buy that. I'd really like to buy a crew member, but um, we're just not in that position. So I think we're going to buy the metal. That will allow us to expand a little more. Let's buy it. There we are. We've bought that metal. That's good. And we're going to remove this one. That should be okay. There we go. We'll remove that. And then... Um, do we want an operate? We kind of want an operations. We want the research station, which is going to take 10. Oh, we haven't got the silicon. Fair enough. Let's expand the hull. So, I'd quite like to put some wings on it. Maybe just a little stubby wing. Um, something like that. But that's. Uh, what's that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's like 12 metal right there. 14. Yeah, it's going to require a lot of metal. Um, could do that, I guess. Can't really have an expansion in there. Could we go? Mm, I don't like the look of that. Uh, yes, looks are important. <laughs> um, kind of tempted to just expand this down a bit what, one further. Yeah, let's go down one more. Go down one more, that's fine. That's going to be 10. Right, let's unpause that. We don't really, can't really do anything with them. Let's, uh, we're going on the times three, that's fine. Here it comes the start. I bet they're going to have, yeah, they've got no heat vents, so they're just going to burn, but there's people in there that can put the fire out, so. <laughs> and yeah, we'll, we'll put windows in the front eventually, but uh, you know, not an essential thing just at the moment. But, uh, I don't think they'll explode or anything, but. Uh, Floors. Let's get some more floors in. And then once... Uh, come on, Mr. Gurk, you're a bit slow. And yeah, there we go. Look, uh, now Man of the People is now watering the garden, so that's good. Uh, let's get another floor in there. So there we are. We'll get that done, and then we can get some food. Uh, it tells you what you're doing as well. Constructing working plants. These two are idle. Uh, ooh, okay, I didn't miss that. Let's put a floor in. Let's slow that down. Uh, that's not good. That could have taken out our CPU panel. Right, let's get some more of this uh, material. If we can. No, that's gone. Let's zoom it out a bit. I mean, I guess we could start drilling that, but uh, we're not really going to break it. Not with, uh, not with the one laser. We kind of need a second one. Do we want thinking do we want a laser turret um, we need another solar panel but that way we could use that to kind of shoot the asteroids and then just mine anything that popped out we could then mine it with the uh, with the mining laser and it would give us a little bit of defense uh, it's heat is gonna be a bit of a nightmare but let's let's see i'm kind of tempted to build that but at the moment we don't have the resources so um you know it's kind of irrelevant let's keep mining though come on oh silicon there we go it's only one but it's still it's silicon that's all we really need uh, there, okay same with that one see that's kind of why i don't want to expand the ship just yet uh, i'd like to put some wings or something on it but 
to be honest. Oh god, yeah, we're not even going to break this thing, are we? No. Oh dear. Please don't hit us. We're floating along with no engine as well, so. Oh, oh, oh. No, we don't want the gold. We want the metal first. As much of that as we can. Oh, no. We lost it. Well, we got some of it. Uh, a second, la uh, second mining laser would also be really good, so. Just, yeah, we kind of need everything, really. Oh, metal. Metal, metal, metal. There we go. Let's break that one. So it doesn't hurt us. Um, yeah, we need some more silicon, really. We can't uh, can't really do much till we get that. Um, we're okay, that, that big one's not going to mess with us. We'll break this one, but, you know, the, if something flies out of it, it could, uh, could just fly off and we can't get to it. Come on, break it, break it. Yeah, no. Oh my god. Okay. Well, we'll break the little one. Oh, there we go. We've got a medal. Ugh. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, this is going to hurt. Ugh. Please don't hit me. Oh, ooh, well, that's not bad, actually. Going for the metal. Uh, we should really go for the systems overheating. I don't care. We're getting as much of that as we can. Right, just put the fires out, people. What? You were asleep putting fires out? Really? Okay, well, that's a... Who is that? Solus, man. You are a talented person there. Sleeping and fire extinguishing. Well, wow. Yeah, we're going to need an engine as well. Just in case a hostile enemy turns up, we could jump out. I mean, we can bribe them, but we've just spent money on metal, so... Uh, you know, we're probably not going to be able to bribe them. Uh, we shouldn't really be trying to bust this one, should we, but... Oh, well, we're doing it now. Yeah, let's try and break that one. Let's break that one. We can. So we've got out of there. We've got no silicon out there, which is really our issue. We're just hurting on silicon at the moment. Like, metal's fine. I mean, water, we'll have that. That's fine. Um, yeah, we need uh, operations. What do we need for the research console? Yeah, we need 10 silicon. I mean, I'm going to put a, I'm gonna put it down. But um, at the moment, we can't really do anything. We need, uh, we'd get, uh, who would we get? Uh, probably get Najik to do, uh, oh no. Uh, probably get Mr. Kirk, actually. Um, he's better at doing that. Uh, get him to do the uh, research. But, um, you know, right now we don't have any silicon. Hopefully a ship turns up and, I don't know, wants to sell us a couple of silicon really cheap or something. Um because all we can now do is float along until something happens. So uh, uh, let's just wait for something to happen, I guess. Right, ship, ship detected on long range scanner. So, if they're hostile, we are doomed. Let's just put it that way. Um, I really hope they're not hostile. If they are hostile, ooh, asteroid field ahead detected as well. Ah. Okay, silicon, we don't have anything. I really want to buy a crew member, but. I don't think it's worth selling 15 metal for 86 credits. It's just not really worth it, is it? Um, yeah, there's nothing there really. Let's just leave that, I think. And uh, they're not currently hostile, that's great. Um, they have stuff, uh, you know, I'd really want to buy a crew member, but um, well, I want some silicon as well, that's probably more, but we don't have enough money. Uh, the only thing we can sell them is food, which we 
don't have much food i don't want to sell all that we can sell them silicon but uh, sorry metal but i kind of want to hang on to that that's such an important resource right now uh, oh okay let's uh, slow it down and we will start mining because we're hitting this asteroid field and so that's what we want uh, they're trying to leave us that's fine they'll also tell you we can't access water and we have no food etc so the uh, crew will tell you things as well um, the spaceship does get dirty but I don't think it really affects them in any way you know um, like real world they'll get upset because it's dirty or they don't they don't mind it a bit dirty or whatever their traits are but uh, in this I don't think all that stuff is implemented so uh, you know dirt and cleanliness and stuff is not really an issue and I don't think they really care if they ate, eat without a table and all that stuff um, so let's just keep mining we got some silicon right cool um, what do we do let's get some more metal I kind of feel like maybe another mining laser just to help us mine this out but we're going to need another vent for that as well star ahead detected so this is going to really hurt us for uh, mining oh okay better come up here need to zoom it out a bit more so we can see what's coming just take everything out that's in front of us that's kind of why i don't want to widen the ship i mean i want to widen the ship for just looks let's get that one because it's flown away no try and get that one come on get your get your cursor on it ben come on there we go systems are overheating i know but um oh we really need that uh, I, I want that research station as well so uh, let's mine that one uh, this is gonna hurt it's gonna jack our heat up really bad yeah we can't really mine it not with this uh not with this star here it's you know it's we're borderline with the heat already they're probably gonna have to stop putting fires out yeah we're I like the plants are on fire that's not good uh, we need another yeah we need another oh my god okay oh boy that's not good do you know what we need another vent if we whether we put a laser on or not we're going to need another heat vent so let's put heat vent out there and uh, get someone to go and do it we have no water oh, da oh dear do you know what we're going to mind that i don't care yeah we need water as well we have no water we are possibly going to die here systems are overheating i know i know i know i know but uh, we need water we need water i can't believe the water's gone oh water oh one piece of water that's something okay we're gonna try and bust this thing open now can't access water do you know what i'm gonna try and get another mining laser up don't think we can do it in time go do that now can't access water uh yeah this is oh crap the water thing's broke oh d seriously okay build that build that now oh damn yeah it took out the water cooler oh dear oh my god oh and there we go there's a the research station gone oh my god i really want that metal though but we need water more than anything okay so we've got a, another mining laser online uh but i bet we don't have enough power do we yes we don't um damn okay yeah they can't access water they have no water i think oh my god oh water 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 Right, let's everybody fill up. Everyone's okay on food. Let's power the food deck. Can we power the... We need to power something down. Uh, what do we need to get that going? Um, mining laser 7 and 10. So plenty... We need... Uh, we need like 5 power. What takes 5 power? Small heat vent? No. Small power... Oh, man. No, we can't power it up, I don't think gotta leave the water cooler on because nobody's had a drink because everyone's thirsty because the water cooler was just broken oh man this is rough i say this game is a rough oh there we go water 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 that's what we need come on 
I want to get that metal as well if I can. Ugh. Okay, right. Well, we've got uh, we've got metal, so we can build. And as it does get dirty as well, you can see dirt. Um, some of those are cracks. They're uh, missed. Yeah, people are fixing those, but uh, yeah, I don't know why you've got uh, Zeds coming off you. As I say, has bugs. Not finished, but uh, there you go. Um, yeah, we lost the research station, so that. Where are operations? So that cost us like 10 silicon. Uh, was it built? I think it was. So yeah, we, we really need silicon. Um, and I, I'd probably like to expand this out, but I kind of want another laser. I would like a mining laser and possibly an actual laser before we expand. Just because, you know, you're making the ship wider. And so you just make yourself a bigger target. So, I mean, I kind of want to add some shape to it. But at the same time, right now, I don't think I want to do that. Um, so I'd like to just put some little wings or something on it. Maybe like that. That on both sides. We've probably got the metal to do that. Something like that is probably what I'd do. Um, could even uh, could even do that. No, I don't really like that. Could do that, but um, that's going to consume practically all our metal. Um, so I don't over want to do that. Plus, it just makes us a wider target for things coming this way. Um, I'd possibly expand this way, but I really want to get some engines on this. But we're just really hurting for that silicon. So we need to build a. Let's just put that down now while I think about it. A solar panel. Let's put another one down. We'll remove those, and we'll remove those. And just as soon as we get some silicon, I think uh, that's what we're going to do. But uh, I think for now, um, I think I'm going to call this one here and in the episode. Uh, so yeah, um, if you want to name this thing, it's just called Escape Pod 2 at the moment. So uh, if you want to actually name it, I guess I could name it uh, something. But uh, well, I'll leave it to you guys if you want to, if you can come up with a name for the ship, that would be cool. And uh, yeah, uh, put your name down if you uh, want to become part of the crew once we actually get some crew members. Hopefully we will do, but for right now it's pretty rough early game. Um, eventually we'll, we'll suddenly start doing well but uh, right now it's really rough because uh, well I've gone on the hardest start as well so uh, you know we've got no resources uh, we've got nothing whereas the medium one you start with a laser and the uh, easy one I think you start with some weapons as well so um, uh, you know but uh, yeah all right I'm going to call this one here anyway in the episode so if you like that one please give me a thumbs up comment with your thoughts down below subscribe for more I really do appreciate it stay safe out there everyone and I'll catch you next time